So, they say when opportunity knocks, don't knock it. Today I'm in Portland, Oregon, and I have a patient who has a four hour or so odd layover. So I took the opportunity to go to Ikea. But you can turn and fight for your freedom. Walk in the light of y'all's might, keep on believing. The enemy lines have been drawn, Satan's deceiving. And that's where I'm at now. But unfortunately, they're not open till 12 today because of the weather. We got a little bit of snow here and shut the place down. That being said, I'm at Ikea because one of the first things I want to talk about is our school bus conversion. For the last three or four years, I've been working on this school bus conversion. And some of you probably know I put videos up at times and I've taken them down and put them up, taken them down. I plan on doing a thorough walkthrough of our school bus when it's completed, which it should be completed by the end of March. March 31st is my deadline to complete that thing and just be done with it. That has been a big project for me. I plan on in the coming weeks to do a full tour of my school bus, show you what, what I did, what it looks like, and then I plan to travel across the country in this school bus. So hopefully it's gonna be a blessing and I just wanna keep you all uh, informed with that project because I really want everybody to be watching and praying for us. So that's the first thing I wanted to talk about, school bus conversion, trip across the country, Stay tuned for that. It will enable you only if you're willing to walk by faith and not by sight. Follow the need to be free with the faith of a mustard seed. Second thing I wanted to talk about was about five years ago, I made a trailer to a video entitled Living by Faith. It's just a real simple video and I set out to make a, make a documentary. Now I got gigabytes and gigabytes of filmed footage. We went, we traveled, we did this trip on the road, went to this event, we did all these things and we filmed it and I wanted to put it all together and just show people what it kind of looks like. However, one morning in my groggy state, I deleted the information. Poof. Just like that. Huh, wow, did that really just happen? You know, I really considered, is, was this the route I was supposed to take? Was I supposed to make this documentary? Maybe God has a reason, you know, I just come to just trust that when things like that happen, there's a reason for it. You don't always understand it. Don't get all upset about it. Just trust that it was the best thing for you. So maybe that's what it was. However, I've always had it in my heart to do something like that and to be more instructional in that area. So a man had suggested to me, maybe I should just make short clips of living by faith and just sim simple life living. I'm gonna take that advice, I'm gonna take that route, and I'm just gonna make short little clips on living simply, things you can do to just simplify your life, just find more peace in this existence that we have. A lot of our lives are just wrapped around with go, go, go. People just wake up from morning to night thinking about how they can make more money and that's not really why we're put here. So maybe I could just make some short little videos about that stuff, and so stay tuned for that. That was the second thing I wanted to talk about. Are you sick of being a slave? To the system got you digging your own grave. Be brave, and you can be free to follow the truth wherever it leads thee. third thing I wanted to talk about was a fundraiser that uh, me and my wife kind of thought up together. We have some friends that moved to Africa to live amongst uh, some people. It's just a small group of people. It's not some big charitable organization or anything, but they moved there. They live with them. They've befriended them. And 
uh, they're trying to help them. Now we really would like to help them as well. And so one thing we thought we could do was try to raise some money for them. One thought we had was giving a CD. We're gonna take 10 of these CDs and give them out to the next 10 people who donate. They're on tldmusic.com. Whatever you donate is gonna go straight to these people, all of it, whatever it is, all of it. And we'll try to do our best to keep track of it and to let you know what your money went to. Hopefully they'll give us some feedback. You'll get one of these CDs. It's not very much, but uh, we wanna do that. So this is something we can do that's really easy. It's something that you can do that's really easy. Five bucks, 10 bucks, 20 bucks, 50 bucks, whatever you wanna do. Just do something, please help these people and you'll get a free CD. So I think that's the three things that I wanted to talk about. We thank you for subscribing. Stay tuned for more because it's going to get exciting. All right. If you're willing to walk by faith and not by sight.